Hi, I'm Brother Carlos Salas. Today is August 8th, 2021, and we celebrate the solemnity of our Holy Father Dominic. This year particularly, we commemorate the 800th anniversary of his death when he went to meet the Lord. I invite you to reflect and pray on the readings selected for this solemnity. These come from the prophet Isaiah, from the second letter to Timothy, and from the gospel according to Matthew, and we'll leave the specific verses in the description. St. Dominic is known as the preacher of grace, because when he spoke about God, he needed to share God's greatness and omnibenevolence. That is precisely what, what we must learn from a saint like him to be disciples of Jesus Christ. When we speak about God, we must do so as the Virgin Mary model for us. He has done great things for me, and holy is his name. The reading from the prophet Isaiah begins by honoring the feet of the preacher, which is something unusual and might be ignored. Isaiah exclaims twice that this beauty is there because these feet bear good news and a message of peace. This message of good news takes the form in the incarnation of Christ, the second person of the Holy Trinity, in the offering of his body and blood through his passion, death, and eventually the resurrection and ascension into heaven. And that is the message that St. Dominic preached during his lifetime. He embodied the teachings of Christ and he taught them to others. So following the words of Christ in today's gospel, we can say that Dominic is greatest in the kingdom of heaven. And St. Dominic continues to preach this message, message of God's grace through the order of preachers that he founded. Each of its members is unique in her own or his own spiritual gifts and talents. And every one of them is unified into one mission of preaching and salvation of souls, which comes from our Lord Christ himself when he sent the apostles to share the good news. So today we celebrate a saint who modeled Christian discipleship for us. May we celebrate with joy that St. Dominic is praying for each of us in our journey of Christian discipleship and preaching the truth of the gospel. St. Dominic, pray for us.